we will talk here about doing testing I will add a project to my solution to be a test project I will call it calc unit testing and then click OK OK test project has been added will now delete the unit testing I will do another one now ok delete it now go beneath changes to chicken the unit testing project click yes and successful now I will gonna add unit testing but I will generate it from my math logic class I will generate for the add right click create unit test and I will say generate for the add function now I'm going to see the add test which tests the add function I will remove this comment statements now and put some values instead of the zero move all of this make this one and two equal three okay everything looks looks fine now we'll go to the test menu and go to the windows to get the test view by opening test view I will must click on refresh and add test appears so now let's run it it says to me that is something wrong oh yeah we need to remove this line and now let's run again and it pass there is other feature called code coverage which is an, an amazing feature if you're using unit testing so I will go to the rotor settings okay and click on code coverage it should tell me how much of code I have covered with my unit tests so yeah I have selected now close it and now we'll run again the unit test and it pass right click now you will see the code coverage result now in the results of the code coverage there is a problem this problem is because we didn't configure the code coverage yet so go back again to the local settings click diagnostic then code coverage and configure we need to tell it which DLL to look at so I will choose the math logic this is the main one that I want to check if I'm covering with my unit testing or not so click OK and apply close run the test again and right click it choose code coverage results and now it tells me how much of the code I have covered if I go now to the calc math logic it says subtract function is not covered by 100% and the add is covered by 100% this is very good if you have a lot of functions and you want to make a good use of unit testing 